I used a Harbor Freight air compressor, a Harbor Freight paint gun, $120 worth of paint, and it came out amazing. All right, guys, what's up? So today's an exciting day. We should be seeing some paint on the boat for the first time. Those of you who are new to the channel, I'm building a home-built speedboat, and I'm doing all everything myself. I have no idea what I'm doing. I've learned everything on YouTube. I thought there was somebody here. I learned everything on YouTube. I've never painted a boat before. Never really done this big of a fiberglass job. So I've been vlogging everything. I've been showing you guys how I do things and I've been getting a lot of good feedbacks in the comment section. So the interior is pretty much all ready for paint. I'm going to be doing a two-tone uh, two paint job on this boat. It's going to be a single stage black in the inside from this line in. So from here, that way, it's going to be all jet black. And then on the outside, it's going to be a base and a clear coat. The reason I'm doing that is because I don't want to risk messing up the inside by having to come in and out with the clear. And I just want to spray it twice and let it sit, make it all nice and pretty. And then on the outside is where, where it's going to be base and clear. Here I'm also going to do a single stage black in this insert right here. But that's how she's looking guys. I've done a lot of body work. And right now I'm just still finding little pinholes that I'm touching up. And once that dries I'm going to sand that down. Get it nice and smooth. I'm going to spray it with some, with some aerosol primer. Some spray can primer. And call it a day. So this is some of the materials that I've been using. This is the, the high build primer that I, been, I was using. This is what I'm using to fill in all the little pinholes. And this is what I'm going to be spraying today. It's a single stage black from high tech. I've never used this. This is going to be my first time spraying a, a single stage. This is going to be my first time spraying a paint. For all you guys who are professional painters, comment down below what I did wrong. Comment down below if I did an okay job because I'm still learning. All right, And I've learned a lot from the comment section, believe it or not. I also went ahead and got some surface prep because the, the last video I did, I was, I was cleaning the surface with brake cleaner and a lot of guys were yelling at me, telling me not to do that. So I got some, some surface prep. I also, I also got a water filter from my compressor. All right. So it's not, it's a little rigged up right now. I still got to mount it to the wall somewhere. But for now, I think she'll be okay. This is the Harbor Freight air compressor that I'm using. Harbor Freight uh, water separator filter thing. And I'm going to be spraying with a Harbor Freight gun. So I went today. And I got a brand new gun with a 1.4 tip. This is the famous $14 Harbor Freight gun. And this is what I'm going to be using to, to paint the single stage. So let me give you a little walk around on my booth. This is a Harbor Freight car canopy that I've kind of converted into a, a paint booth. All right. Nothing fancy, but I think it's going to work just fine so yeah guys that's how she's looking all right uh what else can i tell you i gotta sand the inside still after the last time i i drew the primer i still i still gotta sand my this and i still gotta sand it with 320 grit I'm going to be painting the boat after I use my DA in a 320 grit sandpaper. If you're not already subscribed to the channel, please subscribe. Drop a like. If you're a professional um, painter, drop a um, comment down below what I did wrong. If you do something different. And yeah, we're all learning here, guys. So thank you for the support. Let's get on with the show.
guys. We're ready for some paint. I taped everything up, divided where I want the, the line to be, and I cleaned her up, sprayed a little bit of primer over the spots that were showing, tacked it off, cleaned it up, and I believe we're ready for some paint. Hopefully it comes out perfect. Wish me luck. Remember, this is the first time I paint single stage, so I'm a little nervous. Let's get to it. All right. So here's the fun part, it's four to one, so just try to do this without spilling it. You know what, I saw something on another YouTube channel that this guy did something like this. I've been watching a lot of YouTube, you know, I'm a visual learner. Let's see, let's see if this works. I feel like it'll work, why not? Let's see. Let's see if this wants to work for me like it worked for him. So four. Hey, look at that. Beautiful. Alright. Not bad. Could have been a lot worse. I've been making a lot more messes with the primer. Let's see, another six. All right. We do so. I usually start acting a little silly when I'm nervous. And I'm nervous because I want to do this once. And I don't want to make any mistakes. I want it to lay down flat and have a beautiful gloss. Please just let it have a beautiful gloss with no orange peel. <sighs> Please. I don't know why Harbor Freight Guns love making that noise, but it is what it is. Let's test the pattern. Yep, yeah, I can deal with that. All right. I'm a little nervous, guys. Oh, I think I want to do the front first. All right. All right. So I think I'm going to do this part first. Because the part that I don't really care too much about is the windshield is going to be covering that. So. Cool. Cool. Alright, that's that side. Let's go to the other side. For me, Ugh. all right, baby. This is what I've been waiting for. Let's do this. Let's do this. Never break, always fight, never quit. Do it right, play the game, win it life. No shame, there's no time Feel the pain, with the grind I could change, in my mind Pick a lane, commit and climb The only way, to win it life I never miss that stack Taking big swings, dish ham to the back Put me in the ring, you'll go out in a bag Cause I sing what I mean and I bring it to the mad light Ain't got time to kill, I got time to fail I took the red pill, I know life's short So I wanna live real, but how's it supposed to feel?
they wanna say they hate, but they know it's cap. I ain't play no games, I just do that's fact, and I don't feel no shame. It's a mood you got, I go crazy. Nah, bitch, I ain't lazy. Track after track, I work on the shit daily. Pass me the jack, right as fuel got me hazy. About to unpack all these things I've been chasing. I got visions in my head, like memories after death. To be a legend instead of something you can forget. All right, guys, that's the first coat. She's looking good. I did drip a little bit on one of the corners, but it is what it is. It's nice and gloss black, and she is looking good. It's been about 15 minutes, but she's still not ready for another coat. Paint is still coming off, but doesn't that look pretty? It's not perfect. I know it's not perfect. But for being a DIY first time paint job, I think it looks amazing. Thank you very much. You mother effer, bro. Oh. Oh, you left your legs in there, man. I guess that's what happens when you paint outside, right? Get away from my boat, bro. Let's see if it's dry enough. Nope, we still gotta wait. Still, still coming off. All right, so it's time to lay our third and final coat. See here, I don't have paint over my fingers. But there's no paint coming off. So that tells me we're ready for our next coat. And yeah, there's definitely a lot of bugs in the paint. So I'm definitely going to have to do some wet sanding and polishing next week sometime. So comment down below what's the best method to wet sand and polish single stage paint if you know. Alright, I'm going to put you guys in a different angle. Get this knock, get this done, take the tape off and end the video. So let's do it. Because this looks amazing. I don't think the camera can do it justice, but it's super glossy. And whatever little drips there were disappeared. Disappeared between the second and the third coat. So I'm still gonna wet sand it because there's a lot of bugs in here. A lot more bugs than I was thinking would land on my paint, but it looks amazing. Alright, guys. Like you can kind of see the bugs and little specks and all that, but nothing on wet sanding can take out, right? Alright guys, final walk around before I end the video. I got, I still got to clean the gun, but I'm going to do that after I end the video. But look how beautiful this is. Look at that. Look at this.
I think it came out perfect. I used a Harbor Freight air compressor, a Harbor Freight paint gun, $120 worth of paint, and it came out amazing. I know once I wet sand and polish all those little bugs that landed in the paint, it's gonna be a mirror finish. So tomorrow I'm gonna prep this body panels, tape all that up once it dries, tape all that up, close it off, sand, seal, and paint base coat and clear coat so that's something you guys are going to want to stay tuned comment down below what paint do you guys think i'm going to paint this hall if you guys are real ogs to the channel and you watch all my videos there's one color that i love that's the color i'm going to paint the boat so that's the only uh, hint i'm going to give you guys i hope you enjoy the um this video please subscribe to the channel if you're not already subscribed and stay tuned for the next video, all right? Peace.